share your knowledge. It is a way to achieve immortality. Once a year, go somewhere you have never been before. We can live without religion and meditation, but we cannot survive without human affection. Know the rules well, so you can break them effectively. Although, you may not always be able to avoid difficult situations, you can modify the extent to which you can suffer by how you choose to respond to the situation. When we feel love and kindness towards others, it not only makes others feel loved and cared for but it also helps us to develop inner happiness and peace. As you breathe in, cherish yourself. As you breathe out, cherish all beings. Sometimes, one creates a dynamic impression by saying something. And sometimes one creates as significant of an impression by remaining silent. Judge your success by what you had to give up in order to get it. If you want others to be happy, practice compassion. If you want to be happy, practice compassion. Sleep is the best meditation. Happiness is not something ready-made. It comes from your own actions. Give the ones you love wings to fly, roots to come back, and reasons to stay. The topic of compassion is not at all religious business. It is important to know it is human business. It is a question of human survival. Let us try to recognize the precious nature of each day. The goal is not to be better than the other man, but your previous self. My religion is very simple. My religion is kindness. People take different roads, seeking fulfillment and happiness. Just because they are not on your road does not mean they have gotten lost. The true hero is one who conquers his own anger and hatred. Love and compassion are the true religions to me. But to develop this, we do not need to believe in any religion. If you think you are too small to make a difference, try sleeping with a mosquito. Someone else's action should not determine your response. Our prime purpose in this life is to help others and if you cannot help them, at least do not hurt them. Remember that sometimes not getting what you want is a wonderful stroke of luck. Love and compassion are necessities, not luxuries. Without them, humanity cannot survive. Love is the absence of judgment. Through violence, you may solve one problem, but you sow the seeds for another. It is under the greatest adversity that there exists the greatest potential for doing good, both for oneself and others. When you practice gratefulness, there is a sense of respect toward others. I defeat my enemies when I make them my friends. I find hope in the darkest days and focus in the brightest.